One of the most annoying things about email sometimes is all the email that is being sent to you based off of a some sort of a mailing list that you either subscribe to or did not subscribe to. So I want to show you how to find all of those um, and then deal with them. So the quick way is to go up here into the advanced search bar and then search for email that has the words un subscribe because by law uh, any sort of uh, real subscription service has to have uh, a way for you to unsubscribe so we're gonna create a filter with this search we're gonna see it's gonna pull up lots of emails here in behind so you can see about 93 emails match or has the word unsubscribe so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna highlight them for myself so I'm gonna apply the label and then I'm gonna create a new label I don't have one in here yet so I'm gonna say I'm just gonna call it unsub for unsubscribe I'm going to give it a name and then I'm going to create that label. And then importantly, I'm going to apply the filter to matching conversations. So that means all the email that you see in the background here that matches um, this will also sort of be retroactively added to the filter. And then I'm going to create the filter. Uh, then I'm going to go back to my inbox. So here's my inbox. And then I'm going to go on the left hand side. I'm going to find that um, filter now or the the label, it's probably under more here, so I might have to scroll around a little bit. Here's the unsub one, and you can see that there's 68 conversation. I'm going to give it a label color. I'm going to make it uh, pop out. I'm going to give it this sort of uh, orange color, I think, for today. And I wanted to show you what that filter looks like in real life. This is my personal inbox, and you can see lots of unsub emails here. Google Maps, Strava, uh, Chef Remy, whoever that is, Brittany Muse, uh, that's a different one, uh, Seth Goad, and some of these things. But here's the net result, is that all of these unsubscribe emails will sort of pop out visually in your inbox. And then what you can do, watch this. So let's see, uh, Kiva, we don't we want to keep that one. Let's see if we find one that we don't want. Uh, you can go in and unsubscribe to it. So for example, here's a good one, Nomadics. I don't even know what this is. I don't think I ever signed up for it. I'm going to scroll to the bottom of this email and I'm going to look for the mail or the link that says you can update your preferences or unsubscribe. So I'm going to click unsubscribe, unsubscribe successful because I don't want to get these emails anymore. Um, this might change. This might uh, be different for depending on how you have signed up in the past. But there you go. And then I'm going to just archive that email one less email that I have to read. So that's the, that's the final result. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, good luck with your filters.